Have you ever wondered how a creature that flaps its wings over 50 times per second survives the night? How does the tiniest bird in the world manage to sleep without starving? And what if I told you that it doesn't just sleep, it enters a state so extreme it borders on suspended animation? Picture this, a vibrant hummingbird bursting with energy all day long suddenly falls into a trance-like state each night. Its body cold, heart slowed to near silence, and metabolism down by over 90%. But why? How does this mysterious phenomenon work? And could it hold clues for science far beyond the world of birds? Today, we'll uncover the secret of the hummingbird's nighttime torpor a hidden biological marvel that turns this feathery dynamo into a living mystery. From the jungle canopy to backyard feeders, their nightly survival ritual might just be one of nature's most fascinating adaptations. So before we dive in, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more captivating bird stories, like this one. And if you love learning amazing facts about birds, grab your copy of my ebook, the Ultimate Bird Facts Collection, minus 30, Surprising Truths. Available now for just $7.99. Ready to discover what really happens when the hummingbird sleeps. To understand the wonder of the hummingbird's sleep, we first need to grasp the intensity of its waking life. The hummingbird isn't just fast, it's a biological outlier with a heart that can beat over 1,200 times per minute and wings. That buzz at lightning speed, it lives on the edge of what's physically possible. Every second awake is a race against time and energy. Unlike larger animals, it doesn't have fat reserves to last through long periods without food. That's why it feeds constantly throughout the day, sipping nectar from flower after flower just to stay alive. But this relentless pace comes at a cost. As the sun sets and temperatures drop, the hummingbird faces a dangerous dilemma. How to survive the long foodless hours of the night without burning through the little energy it has left? That's where the magic begins. Because while other birds simply rest, the hummingbird enters a whole new realm, a deep, energy-saving state. That's nothing short of astonishing. This is not sleep as we know it. It's a complete physiological transformation. The state the hummingbird enters each night is called torpor, a temporary hibernation-like condition that allows it to drastically reduce its energy consumption. While we sleep and our bodies slow down slightly, the hummingbird goes much further. Its heart rate plummets from over 1,200 beats per minute to as few as 50. Its body temperature drops to near the ambient air, sometimes by more than 20 degrees Celsius. It becomes almost motionless, unresponsive, like a tiny living statue suspended in time. This nightly transformation is so extreme that, to an untrained eye, the bird might even appear dead. But inside, everything is carefully calibrated for survival. Torpor allows the hummingbird to conserve up to 90% of the energy it would otherwise burn overnight. Without this ability, many species of hummingbirds simply wouldn't survive until morning. What's most fascinating is that this process isn't passive. The hummingbird actively prepares for torpor each evening as if flipping a switch, turning down its internal systems, and surrendering to the cold night, trusting its biology to carry it through. As twilight settles over the forest, the hummingbird begins a deliberate routine. It finds a hidden perch, often sheltered from wind and predators, and hunkers down, fluffing its feathers to trap what little heat remains. Its last meal of the Day becomes critical, a final sip of nectar to top off its energy stores before everything slows down. Gradually, the changes begin. The tiny bird's breathing slows, its eyes close, 
and its temperature begins to drop. The vibrant, darting creature that was just moments ago, a blur of motion fades into stillness. What remains is a silent silhouette, often unnoticed, nestled among the leaves. During this period, the hummingbird is incredibly vulnerable. It can't react quickly to threats, and waking from torpor is a slow process that may take up to 30 minutes, but the risk is worth it. The energy savings during torpor are so substantial that they make this dangerous stillness a nightly necessity. It's a delicate balance, surrendering to vulnerability in order to preserve life, and yet, it works brilliantly. If you were to gently touch a hummingbird during torpor, not that you should, you'd be shocked by how cold it feels. Its surface temperature can fall to near freezing, depending on the environment. For a creature that thrives in warmth and burns energy like a jet engine, this shift to near hypothermia is mind-boggling. But this isn't a system failure, it's a survival strategy perfected by evolution. By reducing blood flow to its extremities and cooling its core, the hummingbird essentially puts itself on pause. In this state, even brain activity slows dramatically, entering something close to a trance. And yet, somewhere deep inside, life still flickers, a heartbeat, faint but steady, a spark waiting to reignite with the first rays of dawn. What's remarkable is that this tiny creature can do this every single night and still bounce back to life within minutes when morning comes. It's nature's version of pressing the reset button. Not just resting, but completely powering down in order to live another day. As the first light of morning filters through the trees, something incredible begins to unfold. The hummingbird, still in its torpid state, starts to stir. Slowly, its body temperature rises. Its heart begins to beat faster. Muscles regain tension. It's like watching a machine reboot. Not all at once, but step by step, system by system. This process isn't instantaneous. It can take up to half an hour for the hummingbird to fully awaken and regain control of its body. During this time, it's still defenseless, perched in silence as warmth returns to its tiny frame. But once it's ready, the transformation is astounding. From a lifeless ball of feathers, the bird erupts into motion. Its wings buzz back to life, and it darts off in search of energy-rich nectar, the fuel it so desperately needs to start the day. This daily rebirth isn't just beautiful, it's essential without torpor and its careful reversal each morning. The hummingbird's high-octane lifestyle would be impossible. It's tempting to think that torpor is simply sleep, but for the hummingbird, it's much more than rest. In fact, scientists classify it as a completely different physiological state. While sleep involves cycles of brain activity and light, consciousness, torpor pushes the body into near suspension with metabolism, temperature, and neural function drastically reduced. Interestingly, hummingbirds don't experience typical sleep during torpor. They sacrifice dreaming and normal rest patterns in exchange for energy survival. This means that what they gain in conservation they give up in restoration. It's a nightly trade-off, a calculated biological risk, even more intriguing, not all hummingbirds use torpor every night. Factors like temperature, food intake, and species type play a role. On warmer nights, some may skip torpor entirely. Others, especially at higher elevations, rely on it as a critical part of their routine. This Adaptability shows just how finely tuned their bodies are, constantly balancing energy, temperature, and survival with astonishing precision. Torpor isn't just a hummingbird trick, it's an evolutionary masterpiece. While other animals hibernate seasonally, the hummingbird does it every single night, 
This daily survival mechanism highlights just how extreme their lifestyle is. They are nature's smallest warm-blooded daredevils, constantly walking the tightrope between energy and exhaustion. What's more, this unique ability has evolved independently in various hummingbird species across the Americas. From the lush tropics to chilly mountain forests, different species have adapted torpor to suit their environments. Some even use a version called facultative torpor, turning it on or off as needed. This flexibility gives them a survival edge. In a world where food can be unpredictable and nights can turn cold fast, it's not just a backup plan, it's a core feature of their existence. In the evolutionary race for survival, hummingbirds may be tiny, but they're running one of the most efficient systems on Earth. What if the hummingbird's torpor could inspire breakthroughs far beyond the natural world? Scientists are increasingly fascinated by this ability to dramatically slow life without harm. Imagine if humans could do the same, entering a state of suspended animation for medical procedures, space travel, or emergency survival. Researchers have already begun studying torpor-like states in other animals for clues. But hummingbirds offer a particularly intriguing model because they do it daily, safely, and with perfect recovery. Their biology holds potential insights into metabolism regulation, heart rate control, and even how to preserve tissue during trauma. Could the hummingbird, in all its fragility and brilliance, help us unlock secrets about the human body? The idea isn't as far-fetched as it seems. Nature has long been our best teacher, and few lessons are as elegant or extreme as the nightly shutdown and rebirth of this feathered marvel. Though hummingbirds are often associated with warm, flower-filled environments, many species thrive in cooler, high-altitude regions where torpor becomes even more vital. In the Andes Mountains, for example, temperatures can plunge dramatically. At night, yet, hummingbirds like the black metal tail survive there. Thanks to their enhanced use of torpor, some of these mountain-dwelling species exhibit even deeper torpor states than their tropical cousins. They can remain in this suspended state for over 12 hours, enduring bitter cold and scarce food supplies. In such harsh environments, torpor is not just an option, it's a lifeline. This ability has fascinated ornithologists, who study how such a tiny bird can endure extremes that would challenge far larger animals. It reinforces one truth, resilience, doesn't depend on size, it depends on adaptation, whether perched in a rainforest or nestled on a rocky cliff. The hummingbird's ability to adjust its biology so dramatically proves that even the smallest of beings can hold the most extraordinary secrets. Every night, across forests, gardens, and mountains, a quiet miracle unfolds. Tiny hummingbirds, who spend their days in a blur of motion, surrender to stillness. They trust their biology, their instincts, and the evolutionary wisdom coded deep within their cells. They fall into torpor, not as an escape, but as a strategy to survive in the darkness. Their hearts slow, their bodies cool, and time seems to pause. Then, with the arrival of dawn, warmth stirs life back into motion. It's a daily resurrection, unnoticed by most, but no less profound. The same creature that seemed frozen and fragile just hours before now zips through the air like a jewel. On wings, this is the secret of the hummingbird's sleep. Not simply rest, but transformation. A glimpse into how life can bend, adapt, and thrive under pressure. A reminder that even in the smallest forms, nature holds vast intelligence. What did you think of this incredible nightly journey? Let me know in the comments, and feel free to share your thoughts, questions, 
or even suggest a topic for our next video. Don't forget to share this video with someone who loves nature as much as you do.